And tonight's look at this, a mansion that sits atop a hill overlooking Silver Lake that's now in the National Registrar of Historic Places. Our Desmond Shaw is over the Garbett House. Well, take a look at this huge home in Silver Lake. This is the Garbett House, perched high above the Silver Lake Reservoir, an historic home that commands 360 degree views of the basin in LA's east side. Built in 1926 for Frank Garbett, he's one of modern LA's more important people that you might not know about. He made his initial fortune in oil, but he was also a big player in the early aviation industry and the company that we now know today as Lockheed Martin. He was also instrumental in the founding of what would become Paramount Studios. And as was the norm for any early 20th century LA mogul, a trophy estate was in order. And so Garbutt acquired 37 acres around this hilltop and had three homes constructed for him and his family. The main home spanning about 12,000 square feet. And what's particularly unique about this house, especially for its time, is that it's made entirely out of concrete, even the roof. This was to withstand natural calamities like earthquakes and flooding, but especially fire because Garbutt was deathly afraid of fire. And that also explains why there are no fireplaces in this mansion. Other unique anti-fire touches include bronze framed windows and steel reinforced doors. So that kind of makes this house just as much a fortress as it does a mansion. Garbutt lived here until his death in 1947. His heirs enjoyed the property until they sold it in 1960. Then there were some preservation battles fought over the property because developers wanted to build as many as 500 condos on the estate but public outcry helped to scale the project back to about 100 homes. However, the two smaller homes did have to be demolished in the process. So the Garbutt home was not only spared, it was actually added to the National Registrar of Historic Places in 1987. Today, it's owned by Dov Charney. That's the founder of American Apparel. There have been some recent developments on that front because according to the LA Times, he's been embroiled in a pretty messy bankruptcy case and he may soon be forced to leave the home so that it can be sold to pay his creditors. And apparently court records also show that other people may be living here, including controversial political figure Milo Yiannopoulos, some people connected to uh, the artist formerly known as Kanye West. You can go find the LA Times article to learn more about that. Very, very interesting. So the nearly 100-year-old home may soon be getting a new owner, and whoever that will be, they will definitely be getting a particularly unique Citadel-like perch here high atop Silver Lake. Take a look at this from SkyCal. I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, write us at lookatthis at cbs.com.